Hey guys, today I'm working with a matching Kenmore washer and electric dryer set. And right now I've got this set on ultra clean. We're gonna do just a regular size load, um, large, warm, cold. Of course, all this stuff gets checked out. Everything gets tested, everything electrical, mechanical, and a 28 point inspection gets checked. And then I do this video as if you were standing here yourself testing it out, put a good load of clothes in there, and uh, you'll get to see that it agitates correctly, drains the water out, and that the spin cycle is nice, fast, and smooth. So all things you'd want to know before you bought something, took it home, and plugged it in. But we'll allow, allow it to get going here, and we'll come back for the sake of time. I, I kind of cut through the cycle. I don't want to stand here for an hour. <laughs> but uh, we'll allow it to do its thing, and we'll come back for it. Great, and it actually just kicked over to the agitation. You can see it's got a nice, strong agitation. That's on the wash cycle. All right, guys, and we're moving out of the wash cycle into the rinse cycle. You can hear it draining, draining all the water out of there nice and fast. So we'll let it move through the entire rinse cycle, then we'll come back on the final spin. All right, guys, moving out of the rinse cycle into the final spin cycle, and it's draining the water right now. So the pump is running, but the tub is not actually spinning. And here in a minute, it'll kick off and switch over to spin mode and start spinning the water out of those clothes. So I'm gonna go ahead and pause it. And I'll come right back when it is at its peak fastest spinning. We'll open this lid up. Of course, the lid switch will kick in, so you can see the lid switch works, uh, and it'll stop it. But that way you can see that it is spinning nice and fast. So there it goes. Actually, it's gonna beat me here. Going with a final rinse and it is spinning now. Still, I'll pause it and come back here, give it a two minutes to get up to full speed. All right, and it's gonna be at about full speed. Go ahead and open this up. You can see it's spinning nice and fast. The lid switch works. And it goes right back into the spin mode. We'll let that finish up, spin all the water out of those clothes. Then I'll get them moved over to the dryer and show you that the dryer works properly. All right, guys, we've got those clothes moved over to the electric matching dryer here. I'll show you, I've got them piled in there. The light and everything works. Lid switch works. You can see by opening it and it stops. We'll just hit it on time dry, high heat with four heat options there. You've also got a cycle signal. Hit go. You can see in here that it sounds great. It's got nice smooth operation. And I'm going to show you that it is heating appropriately. Right in between those two red dots, it's going to take our surface measurement of the temperature. So you see a little difference between the dryer and the floor there. Right inside that heating element tube, we'll get a measurement. Plenty of heat coming out of that heating element tube. The heating element is right behind this panel here. So this tube can get pretty hot, but the inside of your dryer is only going to get from about 95 up to 195. And that's just going to depend on what you have this guy set right here for. So if you have delicates, stuff you don't want to get too hot or go too long, uh, you've also got on the auto dry, you can do a less dry. There's touch up for getting rid of wrinkles and of course just an air dry here as well. But now you know everything on the dryer works. Heats up like it's supposed to. and That's gonna pretty much do it for this set here. We'll go ahead and get it listed up for sale. If you have any questions at all, please feel free to reach out. I do appreciate you taking the time to watch this video. You guys have a great day. Thanks.